I was not really confident in this project until I found this. Despite the project in Jurong already hitting 2800 PSF, but this project in the One North is a small one. I'm worried if this is a good investment. So I decided to burn the midnight oil. I analyzed 135 floor plans and crunched all the numbers at One North. And finally, I found where the real opportunity is. Today, I'll be talking about the new launch condo, The Hill at One North. I'm going to run through the analysis for you. I will also share the price trend of the projects nearby so that you can compare them at one glance to see The Hill at One North can buy or cannot buy. The prime location is the main draw for this project. This is the silicon of Singapore, One North. The hill is located along Sim Barracks Rise, in between One North MRT and Buona Vista MRT. Fun fact here, do you know that One North MRT was initially named as Ports Down? But the name Ports Down might not seem auspicious. Hang uh, in the end, we name it One North, simply because Singapore is located one degree to the north of Equator. For drivers come out to North Buona Vista Road, towards the north, you will find Holland Road. Towards the south, you will find AYE. The hill is developed by Kingsford. This is a small development with 142 units up to 11 storey, ranging from 2 to 4 bedrooms. The small land size is definitely the shortcoming of this project. However, I still believe this project is worth my time to analyse to see if there is any hidden potential to be discovered. Because Media Circle and Clementi Avenue 1 are far away from the MRT, their land cost is even higher. So this could be the final chance to buy a condo near Buona Vista MRT at a reasonable price. Looking at the entire one off, there are only four other projects. Back in 2007, the first two condos in one off precinct were launched. First mover advantage. Now let's see their design. Already more than 10 years old, still looks quite modern and the other one looks like an office tower. But until I look at their floor plan design. For one of residences, the unit size comes with a very wide range. For example, some of the one bedroom can be larger than the two bedroom. For Rochester residences, their units are much bigger. Most of the units also come with huge balconies. Even for the one bedroom unit, they also have a powder room for you to make up. This is a loft unit, so they got a staircase going to the upper floor. And they still have a bathroom. One bedroom comes with two toilets. Ah. But let's see whether the owners make money or not. Ah. Not bad, ah. still got uh, hundreds of owners making profit, but there are still people losing money during the seller's market. So the moral of the story is, sometimes first mover disadvantage. 14 years interval, we don't have any new launches in between until One North Eden in 2021. This time, the developer focused on efficient floor plans. Then in April 2023, we have the latest cooling measure. And the next day, Blomson's by the Park launch. This is the only projects in the entire One North that come with dual key units. I have a long video about this project last year and we still have balance unit left for the three and four bedrooms. You may watch the video if you would like to find out more about Blomson's by the Park. In the previous launch, we noticed that the one and the two bedrooms in One North are super popular. And now, the hill at One North is going to launch in February 2024. But there is no one bedroom. Therefore, the highlight here is the 16 unit of two bedroom and 56 unit of the two bedroom plus study. Let's see what is the safe entry price for the two bedroom units. To achieve this, I need to identify the supply gaps in One North. First, I will check on the resale listing on the property listing portal. I summarize the listed price I found on 31st January 2024. The asking price for a two bedroom resale condo is 1.95 million onwards. That means in One North, there is no supply for the two bedroom below 1.95 million. So this is the supply gaps with strong demand that I'm looking for. But you must be very, very lucky to get a good balloting number. For the three bedroom units, the resale condo listed price is from 
2.82 million onwards. However, we still have balance unit at Blossoms by the Park. The three bedroom dual key price from 2.41 million and the proper three bedroom from 2.66 million. But do take note, there is a four bedroom for sale at One North Residences for 2.6 million. Hence, the supply gap for the three bedroom is below 2.6 million. After reviewing all the floor plans, I've spotted one that truly stand out. Okay, this one, the 1098 PSF. Okay, it is a three bedroom plus study plus bomb shelter. The interesting part is the study room is a good size with a window that can become your fourth bedroom. So in the future, you still can sell this unit as four bedroom. Super rare and efficient layout. But only four units are available. I still don't know how much the developer is going to price, but let's say 2,500 PSF. It will be 2.745 million only. Why I purposely mention only? Uh, because the four bedroom units at Blomson's are 3.38 million onwards. Do you see the huge price gap? And for the four bedroom units at the hill, the floor plan is quite efficient. However, if you have a budget of more than 3 million, you have a lot more better options out there. So here comes the question. The hill at One North can buy or not? In my opinion, still can but only certain unit type the two bedroom three bedroom compact and the three bedroom plus study which is the 1098 square feet can buy the rest want to know how to choose the right project and the right unit i can analyze for you you may contact me via my whatsapp at 9188 i'm the property strategist steven chong hope to see you soon bye